Welcome back, everybody. This is W Balls 03 along with Kenshin 1913. And I need to get some power, man. Yeah, you do. Your health is pretty low there. If I die on easy, I'm going to be one sorry mofo. Your Christmas is going to be totally ruined. Yeah, this will totally ruin my Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, and now we got Pit Viper and uh, I think Yellow Jacket left. Yes. We gotta take those SOBs down. Well, I just ran into Pit Viper and he blew up after I shot him with. Yeah, so Yellow Jacket's basically dead too. I'm just gonna go back and face him with my little pea shooter. If I can. You know, machine gun. If I can drive, I keep driving in circles. Okay. Yo, Mr. Grimm is a little bit drunk. Yes. He's been, he was out, he was out at the bars all Christmas. Yeah, a little bit too much eggnog, which I think is gross, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't, uh, I wasn't real big on eggnog either. I've had chocolate eggnog, which a lot of people think is nasty. I loved it. Yeah. I had it, uh, I, I worked at a, you know, grocery store, that was my last job, and, uh, we, we got chocolate eggnog in, and it was, uh, it was great. Eggnog, I don't know, I just, uh, I never liked the consistency, I think that's, that was my problem. Yeah. <clears throat> but my buddy has, an, he had an idea called Kegnog, where you would, you would keg up an eggnog and then, you know, sell it by the keg. Yeah. Because his wife loves friggin' eggnog like, like no one's business. So he's like, dude, we should, we should totally make keg nog and, and put eggnog in a keg. And I was like, who the hell would order that? He's like, my wife. If my, uh, my, if my best buddy was still alive, he'd order it. Oh yeah, keg nog, see? Yes. People want their eggnog out of a keg. We, at least that's what we thought. Yeah. Oh, there's Hammerhead. Yes. They're double teaming me, him and Darkseid. Yeah, that's messed up. These two giant trucks trying to get on you. Yeah. I gotta get some power. I think this is my favorite level of the game because it's just—it's the biggest level in the game. It's just so wide open. I mean, there's actually three parts. It's this part right here, like in the, you know the royal development. Then you can jump over here, and you're like on a—I um, don't know what the hell it is. But it's like a—it's like a, I don't even know, like a destruction derby kind of thing. Yeah, you get power missiles over here. I like the power missiles. It's like they blew up a giant bridge, damn. Yeah, this is, uh, yeah, this is the other, and I, and I was just on the highway. I like going on the highway, too. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like the, I like the big wide open areas. Yeah. No one is dead yet, though. Nope. I got eight guys to battle with. Oh, and I just wasted... Oh shit! Where the hell are they? Dude? Where are they? you know, being, being pretty wide open, man. You figure if there's eight cars here, you figure you'd see somebody. Yeah, I can run over this guy sitting in his lawn. Oh, <laughs> that's what you get for hanging out during twisted metal. Yeah, on Christmas Eve. That'd be crazy if you were if you were sitting like if your if your neighborhood was hosting a twisted metal. Oh man, I would shit my pants. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I would either hate, well, I definitely shit my pants, but I would hide inside. <laughs> Pray to God that it would get over. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Die, Allah. Imagine, imagine just like getting run over on your own. You're sitting on your lawn. Yeah. And you just run over. That's gonna be the worst. God. I, I know. That, that that would be horrible. Yeah. Oh, I can't get the power up. Damn it. Oh, I can't oh. get. I got it now. Ah, uh, luckily. Oh, sweet tooth's right on your head. Yeah, sweet tooth is dangerous. I'm gonna get away from him for now. I got a pretty funny story about some reckless driving. What's that? All right, my friend, his name's Dan, and he was, uh, 
He was taking his driver's test way back when, and he ended up, what ended up happening was he ended up crashing into a car, I mean, into a tree, huh. in some dude's lawn. Wow. So basically what he had to do was he had to obviously pay back the, uh, the driving instructor company or whatever the hell it was, the driving place that he was taking the test from. So what he ended up doing was getting a job at a uh, supermarket, sort of like yours, and then he basically what he did was he paid for this, for the car and all the damages, and then quit his job. And we're like, dude, why'd you quit your job? He's like, because I paid for the, for the car. I don't, have to, I don't have to work anymore. It's like, dude, you can stay there. And I know. Make money, what the hell? That's hilarious. Was it uh, ghosty? No, it was my friend Ann. He was, he was an easy idiot. Oh, oh, I'm gonna die. I died. Oh no. oh no. That totally ruins my Christmas. Oh no. <laughs> Steve's Christmas will be showered with blood. <laughs> you can't let Calypso have his way or whoever the hell's running this thing. Yeah. That's some of the Yeah. I gotta look. You can totally blow up that gas station too, huh? Yeah. I don't know. I have no idea. I gotta look for a power up, I know that. Yeah, you gotta get some energy back, man. Because yellow is no bueno. There you go. Oh, what the hell? Yeah, that's okay. I'm invincible while I'm getting filled up. I was gonna say, that Warhawk guy, where was shooting at you? That's messed up, man. I know. You can't be shooting at me while I'm trying to get my energy back. You're lucky. Well, at least we're lucky the uh, the uh, computer's not smart enough to jump on in the old energy pad thing. Man. I know. I would oh, be, in, be here forever. Yes, I'd be in for some trouble. Take that, Warhawk. Die. Son of, army son of a bee. Yeah. You got him. Two down, six to go. Yeah, but this tree, this tree that was in the guy's yard is like the tree you're coming up to on the right right there. Uh-huh. It literally, it was literally, it wasn't just like near a sidewalk, it was at, it was literally like on his, on his friggin' lawn, it was crazy. <laughs> I was like, how did you do that? And he, he never explained how he did it. Yeah. Like, did like a moose come out of nowhere and just he jerked the wheel out of the <laughs> Oh, jeez. So he was yeah. ta- he was taking his test, or he was just taking like driver's ed in school, or no, something. No, he was he was taking his driver's test, and then obviously he failed that time. But yeah, I bet. <laughs> oh yeah. That would totally kill my confidence of going back and passing. I know. I'd be like, uh, I don't, I don't know if I want to drive. Yeah, I, w- I would totally be, I don't know, scarred for life whenever it comes to driving. <laughs> I don't know if I'd have the confidence to actually go back. And just think, if you go back and you get the same guy. Oh, that would suck ass. You know, he'd be like, oh my God. just think, just think of that if you were the guy, you'd be like, oh, shit, not this kid again. Oh, not this kid. We're not going to drive down any house. We're not going to drive down any streets with, with <laughs> houses with trees in front. Oh, shit. That would be funny to watch that. Yeah, that would be, I wish I, I wish I had a camera when I get a kid in the tree, man. Oh. Uh, like to see that guy's face like when he's whenever that kid comes back oh man he probably been, hor- he'd probably been horrified like, get the hell out of here <laughs> nice you took down the sweet tooth there good yes and I got a, some homing missiles when I took my driver when I took my uh, my driving uh, test there were two driving instructors that were giving it out there was the asshole <laughs> And then the nice guy, and so yeah. me and my buddy Chris were counting down, like, who was going to get who, because they kept coming back, like, at a, a regular interval, interval, and I was like, shit, yeah, I'm going to get the nice guy. I ended up getting the asshole, uh-huh. and my buddy got the nice guy, and that, that asshole, he tried to, he almost failed me because of, because of, he said that I didn't turn my blinkers on when I was doing a three-point turn. Yeah. I fools did. Uh, Somehow that guy's watching this video, screw you, man. <laughs> yeah, like Kevin says. Yeah. Yeah, like Kevin was, like, if his, if his, if his boss from Wendy's actually watched this video. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. There's always... Do you want your 
driver's test. Well, okay, I took it three. Okay, I passed the permit, the computer test, the first time. I passed it the first time. Okay. Um, the actual driving test, the first time I went, me and my mom were just passing by the DMV. And she's like, you know what? You should take it and see how well you do. I had no practice, nothing. So I failed the parallel parking thing. Okay. Um, the second time, I did. A, I practiced a little bit. I did everything right. I got the dickhead the second I got the nice guy the first time. I got the dickhead the second time. I did everything right except for one thing. I didn't come to a complete stop. He failed me because he said it was a rolling stop. So, yeah. So then I went back the third time. I got the nice guy again, and uh, he passed me. Nice. Yeah. It's, it, really help, it really helps when you get the nice guy, the fucking dickheads. Yeah, there's always one dickhead and one nice guy whenever it comes to taking your driver's test. Oh, yeah. I don't know, I don't know. I don't know why it's like that. I don't know if that's like a, a requirement. They have to have one nice guy and one dick. Yeah, for the, for the DMV. Yeah. Don't even get me started on the friggin' lines there, jeez. <laughs> There we go. We got a kill in Crimson Fury. Yes. So we're down to the the rock like that. <laughs> we're down to uh, I'm gonna get some power. Yeah, you got three guys left. Oh shit, Spectre's somewhere around here. Yeah, and he's almost ready to die. Yes, he is. He's that white little dot. Oh, they have different colors for the dots. Yeah, Spectre, I believe, is white. Nice. And you see that? I he's in the second game, too. Yeah. Where is he at? Where are you at, Spectre? There he is. You're going to be a ghost. He's dead. Bam! Now you got Pit Viper and another guy. I think it's Hammerhead. Hammerhead. Hell yeah. Yes, I freezed her. What a shot. Oh, then I got... Oh, I hit one of those bumpy things. I hate those things. Yeah, I hate, I hate the things that, that bump you around, too. Yeah. There's a girl on the other... There's a girl on the second game. I think her name's, like, uh, Grasshopper or some shit like that. <laughs> and she does, like, a... She does, like, a big bumpy thing, too. It pisses me off. Yeah, I hate whenever they drop those things. Yeah, it totally disorients you, man. Take that pit viper, you suck. Yeah. Come on, come on, blaster, blaster, blaster. Oh, oh, we're going head to head here. Oh. Huh? Looks like, uh, well, I was going to say, look, looks like you're going to win this game of chicken. Yeah. Oh, can I get her? Yes. I got one more to yes. go. I'm going to get some, uh, especially going, uh, going up against uh, Hammerhead. I got a. Uh, Grab some health and some weapons. Yeah, because his special power, of course, is to run over me, and I need, I need all the power I can get. Hell yeah! What the hell is he? Oh, there's the green guy. There he is. I'm using the freeze missiles. There you go. Oh, I got a special. Oh, it's oh, he's almost dead. Look at that, that special took away a shit ton of damage. Yeah, man, his Mr. Grimm special is awesome. He's the shit. Oh, oh, he's almost dead. I just need some missiles. What's up here? Fire the missiles. Yes. There he is. There he is. Oh, oh I got him. Oh. Take that hammerhead. Yes, and I'm at the rooftop. And I, oh, shit. I gotta, Three guys. Yeah, I got to fight hammerhead again. Now, can you fall off the roof and die? Yes. I think that's the only thing about God mode in the second game that, like, if you fell off the roof, you still die. Yeah. And, and if you shoot this, let me see. I usually don't like to waste my special on it. But you can shoot this center thing, this pyramid-looking thing. Holy crap. There, it explodes. And there's a... You can get your power back up. And if you shoot these tree things, it's a... Uh, oh, jeez. 
I'm gonna get to hell. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm just gonna. Oh, Amber Heads kicking your ass. Yeah. That's why it's, it, it is good to have somebody roll fast in this level because you can easily jump the tops of the skyscrapers to get to one area. Like right, like right here, you can just jump over. Oh, jump on rooftop to rooftop like Batman. Yes, and you know what? We're going to have to end it. So this has been W Balls 03 along with... Kenshin 1913. And we'll see you in the next episode. Have a Merry Christmas.